My name is Christy Nochi Gupta. I'm from the University of Wisconsin-Eau Claire. I'm a new faculty member there. I just started two months ago. Um, and so I was pretty sure I was not going to come to this ECS meeting because it was a huge expense to right away ask my chair to fund. My name is Oliver Rodriguez. I'm a Mexican student at the University of Southampton doing electrochemistry. Hi, my name is Rebecca Skelton. I'm from the University of Virginia. Um, to travel here, it took about two flights, about four or five hours worth of flying. If I did not get this travel grant, I would not have come. I would have asked someone else to give my presentation. So going to conference, I think, is a, is a very important part of, of, of being a, a, in academia. So, so I would probably just get a, get a loan or get a credit uh, to, to pay for this, this week. And hopefully I will somehow uh, cover it later in life. <laughs> Having the travel grant allowed me to um, buy a plane ticket where I could have a checked bag because I was afraid I was going to have to pack everything into just a carry-on. It's like, oh no, I have professional clothes, what am I going to do? So that was really helpful. <laughs> I came to Electrochemical Society meetings as a graduate student, so I feel like I have a community here. And I also am at a university where I'm the only electrochemist, so it's a really great opportunity for me to interact with other people who are doing similar research. I've seen some people that I kind of recognize from their papers and I'm like, oh man, like it's just um, unbelievable to be able to have this opportunity to be here with people that I know and that I see that are who I cite on my work. And it's, uh, it's just realizing that the electrochemistry specifically is a very, very small community in the world and that we're part of it. My field is a little bit specific in ECS, it's the corrosion division. I know it's smaller division, but um, we have a pretty tight-knit community. So when you start meeting people, you really, you meet them and you learn to know them really well. So getting the travel grant meant that I felt comfortable to come and meet colleagues as a faculty member for the first time, uh, look at the exhibition and think about what I'm going to order for my research lab. So I'm very excited to have the travel grant and to be here. I think donating to ECS would be so important for travel grants because they really change students' lives. It's really an awesome stepping stone and jump start for people who are starting their independent research careers. Please, it's important, support ECS travel grants. We hope that it contributes to the development of the scientific and technological world. Thank you.